Okay, folks, so the goal here is to see how much difference some clicks make on the compression or the rebound. Can't remember if it's compression or rebound. Adjustments on these Walker Evans shocks that you may or may not have. Uh, I'm just going to run a section of trail here. I just got to get this thing off. Just going to run a section of trail here. Um, right down there a few times with the GoPro fixed on uh, the front shocks here. And we're going to see, uh, I think I'll do three clicks at a time just to see what kind of effect there is on the on the suspension itself, uh, just to give you some idea. Obviously there's gonna be a difference, but how much of a difference in movement is kind of what I'm wondering. So I'm not sure how much else there is out there on actually having a focus on the shock to see how much difference these clicks make. So just curious to see myself and if I am, maybe some other people are as well. So I'm gonna clean off the lens, I see there's gonna do three clicks at a time I think we'll start soft we're gonna start soft and work harder is what we're gonna do yeah that's what we're gonna do so I don't even know where I'm at right now somewhere in the middle it's definitely not at stock setting I have I have messed with this a little bit so I'm gonna go three clicks back on either side one two three towards the soft and I do mess with the back as well, but I'm not, it's just too difficult to do out here, so I'm not going to. One, two, three. We'll assume that the same kind of thing will happen as you adjust the back in a similar way. So we're just gonna mess with the front today. We'll go three clicks at a time. I went three clicks softer on each side than what it was set at. And uh, when I get to the end of the trail, I'll turn around. We'll do three clicks harder, uh, which will put it to what it was set at. And then three clicks harder again and see how much difference there is. Okay, I'm gonna mount this up now so that it's focused on, focused on the shock itself. Uh, we're in anything. Uh, Okay, I'm gonna push that here out of there like that and then walk that down until that goes okay. Let's see what happens. Should be interesting. All right, woo! Three clicks softer. What it was. I will, I will try to run this trail the same each time. Very short, ungroomed. Not super rough, but rough. three clicks softer so I'm gonna go three clicks harder now I just want to see if it's focused the same it is three clicks harder one two three one two 
three. We'll run it again. The same, kind of similar riding. See what difference it makes. So that is what I normally have it set at. We'll see if you notice the difference, and I'll check if I did. And go three harder now than what I would normally ride. One, two, three. One, two, three. And see what that is. We had a six quick spread now. Okay, out of curiosity, might as well keep going. Three more. One, two, three. One, two, three. Whoop! <laughs> I fell. Woo! Ah, boot just sunk through the crust. It's a hot day today. Okay, we'll see how that affects things. three more why stop there i could feel it getting stiffer i think that one for sure one two three one two three i think this one's gonna be pretty stiff i think that's gonna be pretty stiff we'll see
sure you can see it's starting to feel definitely stiffer. I'll be surprised if I get three more out. The other thing that's happening is I'm starting to break through the crust. So anyway, one, no, that's at full stiff. So that's, that's where we end, I suppose. I'm just gonna, one, Okay, so I'm going to reset it back to where I normally ride at, which was one, two, three, one, three. You know what, I might try it at six off of that. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two. You know what? So I'm going to do one, two. Okay, let's see what a difference. This little roll, this is about where it normally would be at. I think I did one stiffer. Interesting to review the footage and see how that all looks. Um, yeah. Until next time, I guess I'll say the old like subscribe thing. I'll put in maybe some suggested other videos right now as well. Uh, we something I forgot to mention. I just uh, turned it back on to mention this right now. Something I forgot to mention was that the. I didn't adjust any of the back suspension whatsoever, but as I altered the front suspension, it felt like as the front got stiffer, definitely made the back wander more too. So uh, what you're doing in the front seems to me like it's definitely impacting what's happening at the back, which makes sense, you know, as the front kind of jumps around and wanders around, it's gonna impact the front of the track. So. Uh, yeah, it'll be interesting to see the footage. Okay, thanks again. Over and out.